Now we continue uh, sharing new experiences with other uh, colleagues that we have met here in Battle of Mexican Porto. Now we have uh, this opportunity to have a small talk with Simon Wunderlich, that uh, he belongs to Batman uh, Development Team. Please, uh, Simon, tell us the scope of your, of your job and what are exactly you doing in this project. In Batman? Well, uh, for one thing, I'm developing features uh, which communities or also commercial customers request. Um, I'm also uh, doing maintaining things like, for example, if there are new versions or if there are bugs, we try to fix them. And if people send in patches, we review them. And yeah, we use the better mesh uh, also to meet with the other uh, Batman developers because they are spread around the world so I'm living in Germany so people live in Hong Kong and it's a, it's a good way to, to meet here or, uh, at the Batman mesh. Why did you get motivated to work in Batman? Um, that's a good, good story actually. I, I think it uh, started 10 years ago when I was working on a, a different open source project, um, it was uh, had something to do with 3D display. And one thing I, I did was to make a uh, 3D visualization of a mesh network. And at that point, I met some people from iFunk, and he, they were really interested in it, and also helped me in my open source uh, 3D project. And at the same time, I became interested in the mesh software, so in turn, I helped them to work on that. Uh, at some point, I didn't really work anymore on the 3D stuff, but only on mesh networking. Um, yeah, <laughs> so this is how it started. Great, right. and finally, how do you see Batman in the near future? In the near future? Um, yeah, it, uh, it's getting adopted by a lot of communities. Um, uh, new communities are starting up all the time, um, also in Germany, but I also see it uh, worldwide, like in Colombia. Uh, so we get also get a lot of feedback from that, and I think that's that's great to see that uh, that effort pays out. Thank you so much, and thank you so much for. Seguimos compartiendo experiencias con muchos compañeros que hemos encontrado en el evento Battle Mesh Version 9 en la Universidad de Oporto. Ahora ellos se van a presentar en sus lenguas. No, please present yourself in, in your native tongues, please. Okay, first. Yeah. 안녕하세요. 저는 Kim Now in Korea. So I'm graduating in, in, in the, the computer engineering in the master course in the Ken University. So I really uh, like them to learn about the machine network. So uh, I will, uh, I came here. So. Okay. Hello, everybody. This is Sibi from. Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu is a state in India. So we basically work with free software movements, building communities and other stuff. And this is my first batch. Thank you. And you please tell us what's the kind of job you are doing in South Korea, regardless of academic or in the real field. So yeah, we want to <coughs> uh, visualize something like the, the kind of mission that works, uh, especially uh, we use the Batman Advance, so we want to uh, visualize something and then, then we want to start organizing the machine network. So, yeah, that's all the Estas son algunas de las experiencias que nos hemos encontrado en este gran importante evento de las Américas. Korea, so we have to uh, create something, something like that. So I think 
Is it possible for you to, to create a community network in Korea? For you? Thank <laughs> you.